But this is another video for both Oculus Hut and Mini TV Stick. It's really a video to provide some feedback uh, to Sebi um, on the Oculus VR forum. I'm not going to speed this video up just in case anybody else wants to try this out or if any of you are waiting for your Rift and just want to see the install process. So you can, you can see I'm, I'm just on the uh, developer forum there. I install straight onto my stick, uh, my mini TV stick. So I'm using a CloudNet CR9. And as you can see, the head tracking's working. So that was good. So apologize for the, the plants in front of the TV, but I just want to show you that the head tracking is working and it's very little latency actually for on, on this particular Android device. Anyway, once I saw it working on TV, I then plugged HDMI into my Rift and I can't really show you here, but basically the tracking works fine on, on my device. And yeah, when I move my head around, I, I can see things move around inside the screen. However, the, um, as somebody else has mentioned before I'm already, it's not distorting. Um, so I said, I think Sebi, you already know that. Um, but I just want to show you the, the tracking's working. Here is the kit, so you can see the Oculus Rift. What I've got in terms of the HDMI is the HDMI goes straight into the Cloud CR9 device, and then that's the power for the for that device. And then there's a USB connection there, so I'm expanding out that. I'm expanding that USB to a, a USB hub. I'm using a USB hub because I'm connecting not only to the Oculus Rift, but I've also got a remote control. So that's got a receiver and then, yeah, that's it. So this is the RC11 remote that I use to control. And uh, yeah, that's my setup. Anyway, there's more information on the website for the peripherals if you're interested, just so you know what I'm testing with. But anyway, thanks for sharing the, the APK. And yeah, I'll keep on testing them if, if you keep on producing them. Thanks, bye.